Hi, I wanted to do a really quick flip through of my Hobonichi cousin for August and um, also share the Hobonichi paper books with you and um, kind of give you an idea of how I'm using it in my cousin even though I haven't used any in my cousin as I flip through it. I thought I did but I can't find any in there. But in case uh, you are deciding that you may want to buy the Hobonichi paper book for 2021, the 2021 sale starts next week, September 1, 2, 3, and I think October 1, depending on what you want to buy. Um, but yeah, so let's go through the cousin first. Uh, as you can see, it's gotten really chunky as it's been, um, again, been taping in um, comic strips, photos, things like that. So let's start off with my weekly layout. So this is what it looks like for the week. Uh, so today is Wednesday, so I need to fill that in. This is yesterday. And this is what last week looks like. I decided to go with more, using more washi tape, stickers. Uh, these are actually tabs, paper tabs. I love shopping at Daiso for what, like $1.50 or something. And um, I can't say no to stationary items. I have a lot, need to use them up. So started sticking them in. So this is the week before. And before that, before that, I did not want to use any washi or stickers or anything like that so I just wanted to try to fill it in and that's what this looked like doing that so this is the weekly um, layout in the cousin which is in the beginning of the book and if you remember it does have the monthly things which I've been using had been using to keep track of the Hobonichi challenges writing down the prompts on the side Okay, so uh, again, this is what, or how I'm using the weekly layout, Hobonichi Cousin, and I need to fill out today's, which I will do after I'm done here, and then for August, let me show you that really quick. Uh, so I finally got in finally got around to using my watercolors to color in, color in my, some of my doodles. Um, you know what, while I'm showing you this, so you can see how I taped in um, the day, this comic, using washi tape or tape. That's how you would basically use any of these three books. Uh, so really quick, so you see the cover of the image, and that's what the page looks like, and all the pages look like that. So that's that one. This was from last year that you could have bought for this year. <laughs> but it's the dog. And each page looks like that. The paper is not Tomo River. It's slightly, I think it's a little thicker. And it's, um, and there's, I think this is the one before that. Same thing. And then just so you can see how easily they pop out. If I were just to rip one out, it comes off really easy. And then what I would do is I would put, you know, my photo on here, extra writing if I wanted to write something, do a little something, put a ticket on it, whatever. And then I would just tape it in, put it in, and then tape it using washi, invisible tape, however you want to seal it down. And then it becomes like a little, what's under there? Yeah, so it, it would just flip <laughs> like that. Um... My husband's under there, that's why I'm not flipping it all the way. But it would work like that. So that's a watermelon that I tried to grow and it didn't grow as big as I had hoped. But you can see how this thing moves up. Just like this one, Oop. Which is what this Hobonichi paper would do if you taped it, if you taped it down. It could go this way, that way, or that way, depending on how you tape it down. Um, yep, so there's, oops, sorry about that. I bought a new stand for my camera to try to record, and uh, I'm making it move a lot, so I, I am sorry about that. Um, and then 
here. Um, the ranch fire started on the 13th up in the mountains and you can see the smoke. I don't think it's 100% contained yet as I'm writing this, though we haven't smelled anything or seen any smoke in the past couple of days, which is which has been great. And then there's my carrot. Can you see it? Look how crazy he looks. I didn't think I'd ever be able to grow a carrot like that, but it looks like somebody's bottom and legs. I thought he was pretty cute, so I had to take his picture. And I think that is the end. There's Bruce, there's my plants. Oh, praying mantis. I found a white one and a green one. And after I took this photo, they, they disappeared. So now I'm kind of afraid to go back to the backyard because they're pretty big. And uh, I don't know where they are. And I don't want them crawling on my back or anything. Um, found dragon fruit on my mom's dragon fruit plant. And then there's Bruce there. So this is a quick flip through of my Hobonichi cousin and the paper books. I do plan on getting the 2021 paper, Hobonichi paper book. Um, I think they're cute. I like using them. I don't really need any more, but the image is different. Uh, so can't say no. And then um, haven't decided yet on my 2021 cousin cover. Haven't decided. It's There's a lot to think about. Um, but anyways, I hope you enjoyed this video. It was a quick one. If you like this video, please like and subscribe. I hope to be more consistent with my uploading of my um, how I'm using my Hobonichis. And um, I'll talk to you later. Let me know if you guys decide on what you're going to buy for 2021, if you're going to buy anything at all. Okay, I'll see you later. Bye.